What's up guys, this is Rissam from RossmoreTech.com. How are you guys doing? I'm doing well. Hopefully you guys are doing well too. Now, you guys are probably wondering, why do I have so many single board computers? You guys are thinking I probably have an addiction to single board computers, which is probably true, but that's not the point of this video. I, if there's a single board computer like rehab, I'd probably be the first one to go. But again, that's not the point of this video. The point of this video is to show you guys my Raspberry Pi and single board computer collection because you guys have probably been wondering. Some of you guys have been asking how many I, how many I have. I haven't shown all of them at once. You know, I've shown them all like in separate videos, but this is all of them at once right now. I have a shelf right here in my closet. This is my closet. It's pretty big. I'm going to show you the top of my closet. That's like all my boxes, my computer gear, my motherboard box, all that stuff. I have like some random crap everywhere. Like my, 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 my closet is just like dedicated to like single board computers and other stuff. That's like my uh, maker, maker shelf there where I have like the soldering iron. I have like the levelers and all that other stuff. I have the helping hands and all that stuff you would use to like starter stuff and tinker. So I have all that stuff. I have a lot of other stuff I'll show you guys later on in another video. But in this video, I just want to show you guys my Raspberry Pi or my single board computer collection. I have a lot. We're going to start off with the first one that I got. The first one I got was the original. Or I don't know if this is the original. This is like close to the original Raspberry Pi. I used it in a bunch of videos and I, I fell in love with it. So I bought the Raspberry Pi B+. Now that's Arch Pi on top, but right here, this is a Raspberry Pi B Plus. I have a lot of them. I don't know which is a Raspberry Pi B Plus or which one's a Raspberry Pi 3 on, uh, right here, but they're all mixed in right now. But the Raspberry Pi B Plus is the one that got me to fall in love with like single board computers because it's the first uh, Raspberry Pi that I used in a uh, supercomputer build where I, where I took like a bunch of Raspberry Pis and I made a cluster supercomputer. So I thought that was cool. Then, then I got the Raspberry Pi 2, which is this uh, middle box is here and the one on top. And then they're scattered throughout here somewhere. But I didn't build any uh, cluster computer using the Raspberry Pi 2, but you know I did use them in a bunch of videos. Now, skipping to the Raspberry Pi 3, I have a bunch of those as well. Four or five, I don't know, maybe six. It could be more. I lost track and I lost count. But I've used those in a new cluster supercomputer build. If you guys want to know more about those cluster supercomputer builds, I'll leave a link to all the Raspberry Pi cluster, sorry, Raspberry Pi cluster supercomputer builds in the description. If you guys want to learn more, but yeah, I, I don't have just uh, Raspberry Pis by the way. Oh, I forgot to show you guys the Raspberry Pi zeros. I have a bunch of these that I didn't do any videos on, by the way. No, actually, I did one video where I, where I water cooled a Raspberry Pi Zero. Other than that, I didn't do much content on the Raspberry Pi Zero because they were hard to get. And once I got them, they were already like old news, you know? <laughs> so I have, I think, like six of them. The one that's in here is on my desk now. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six of them. If you guys have any ideas, leave the comments. Leave it in the comments, sorry. And I'll look at all you guys' ideas. I want to do something with all those uh, Raspberry Pi Zeros. Maybe build a cluster. But again, leave me uh, leave me good feedback. Leave me your suggestions. And I'll take all your suggestions into consideration. And, and I'll pick a cool one. And we'll do a video on that. But I also have the Latte Panda. I freaking love the Latte Panda. And uh, DF Robots were kind enough to send that to me. And I'm really grateful. I also have the Orange Pi PC. This is not the Orange Pi PC, by the way. It's on my desk over there, and I'm testing it. That's my like test rig, water cooling test rig, with my uh, portable monitor right there from Jashik. And that portable monitor is freaking amazing. Now, if you guys are wondering how am I getting these angles, because I'm on a freaking chair right now, and this chair is like a 99 cent store chair, and it's like creaking and making weird noises, and I don't think it's going to support my fat ass anymore because I weigh like 175 pounds. I'm sorry, 185 pounds. Yeah, this chair is not going to hold me up. <laughs> uh, I have a fat ass. No, my fat ass is definitely going to break this chair, so I shouldn't be standing on this for too long. Now, the reason I did this video is for some inspiration. I want you guys to help me out. And I, I want some more ideas on like things I could use these single board computers and Raspberry Pis for. And I also want feedback. I want to, I want to know if you guys uh, like these type of vlog style videos because I don't do many of them. And I know some, some of you guys do like them, but if you guys do like them and you want to see more of them, then like this video. If I see a lot of you guys like it, then I'll definitely do more vlog style videos. All right, guys, so that's pretty much it for this video. I figured I'd just show you all my Raspberry Pi collection that I have here. 
and uh, and I also show you that I do have a Raspberry Pi addiction, so I am seeking help for it. I'm sure there's some sort of like single board computer rehab out there. I'm gonna go Google it, and once I find one, I'm gonna admit myself right away. But again, this is it for the video. If you guys like this video, please give me a like. If you want more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. I'm Rasim from RasmerTech.com, and thank you guys for watching.